Hey guys, welcome back to Buddy RC. I'm Clay and this is Dan. Uh, we just built this beautiful OMP Edge 60 inch and uh, we're gonna see how it flies today. So, uh, so what we got in this thing here? So this is the uh, plug and play version. Okay. So every component on this is what I put on my ARF, except for the servos. It comes with the servos ESC. Oh yeah. I would, I would highly recommend the plug and play. They're just as fast as the ones I put on there. The ESC is strong enough. It's, yeah, I couldn't tell the difference. It flew great. I love it. It's got a lot of power. It's insane power. <laughs> you saw it earlier. It kept climbing and climbing and climbing. Heck yeah. that off of it. It did. It did. Well, we're out here flying with the FR Sky X20S. Um, it is a beautiful transmitter and it actually matches the yeah. plane. You think I like red? <laughs> Red's, red's, <laughs> red's his favorite color for sure. But we're going to take this thing up and we're going to see how it flies and uh, go from there. So let's go fly it. All right. Thanks. All right. Taking off. Now the wind. Of course. <laughs> Smooth. Man, that thing looks so good. <laughs> oh man. Even in the wind, that thing just keeps going straight. That thing tracks amazingly well. Yeah, it's got power. That color scheme looks amazing too. Dude, I love this red. It shows up. The checkerboard on the bottom is awesome too. You can really tell which way you are, uh, which way you're pointing. We're coming in for a landing. No, we're not. No, Go around. No, we're not. Go in. Landing left to right. I think just wants to keep going, doesn't it? Does. It just keeps coming up. Going around. I'm, how do you slow it down? I mean, I have zero throttle. <laughs> it's a good flying plane. Butter. Butter. Look at that. Look at that. It looked like too much fun, so I'm gonna try it. Yep. It's called Pass the Transmitter. This thing flies so good. I'm shaking now. <laughs> I haven't flown a plane in so long. 3D. I know. <laughs> Don't know how to do that. I don't even know what I'm doing. You're just banging the sticks, huh? Yep. What you do? That's a 3D flyer. That's what I mean. It's got so much power. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, it flies amazing. That's what I mean, and that's all plug and play too. That's... Three minutes. See you later, little buddy. <laughs> That's about as pop toppy as I can get. I don't even know what that is. Is that a clock talk? <laughs> That's a cuckoo clock. I'm having too much fun. Do we know how much battery this thing has? <laughs> We're probably getting close. I'll do one more. It's for the size of it though, it floats. I mean, it's definitely a 3D plane. It's awesome. There we go. I blew off a whole bunch of speed by doing that. Look at my thumbs. I know. <laughs> there you go. That was beautiful. Dude, that thing is awesome! Man. So that's the first time you've ever flown one of our 3D planes, isn't it? Our edge. Yeah, I really want to go back up. Do we have more batteries? We got seven more batteries. Let's change the battery and go up right here. 
All right, I just gotta tell myself that if I hit any of these, it's fine. None of them are active. Okay, cool, because I hit that one and it made a noise. I was like, oh gosh. Whew. That's fun. See, there's the gyro, everything, all in one. So how do you feel? I love it. He's excited. I want one now. <laughs> I was slowly remembering how to do 3D with a plane, because I'm normally used to doing 3D with a helicopter. Planes are a little different, uh, but uh, and also I'm also getting used to this radio while we're in the air. <laughs> Never flown one of these, so. Let's uh, get another battery. Let's go get another battery. Yes. Dude, look at how straight it tracks. Mm -hmm. It's really windy up there. Yeah, it's pushing it that way. Yeah, it is. Dude, it's precise too. Four minutes. It's really precise. Did you hear this? You could hear the wind on that. That was cool sounding, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh yeah. Listen to. Dude, that sounds so cool. Hopefully, you can get that on camera. That is a cool sound. All right, I'm gonna try to bring her in and hand her off back to Dan here. The old porpoise to get her to slow down. A little harder, but that's all right. All right, Dan, I'm gonna hand it back to you so you can fly it. Right. This thing's too much fun, I gotta share it. Not one to share, it's so much fun to fly. Hey, fly it all you want. I and it's even going over grass. Yeah. That's long grass, too. Oh, I knocked off your skirt. Oh, well. Dan, <laughs> that's an awesome blame. All right, so the wind's going that way. Come on, come on. It's got so much power, it almost doesn't even matter. Here's a pop top. Oh. See how it, need, it needs just a skosh more uh, tail heavy. Yeah. We'll have to move that battery around, but see, I tried to do that. I was like, eh, it doesn't have much, does it? A little Cuban 8, nice. I, I, like I said, I think it might need a little bit more tail heavy. But it would be so pitchy in this wind, it would The, the wind is yeah, taking it that way. Like that it's very windy out here, if you guys haven't noticed. Uh, it's <laughs> it's it's probably what 15 20 mile an hour winds yeah but when you get below the trees everything kind of dies off because our wind suck is doing nothing right now and i can tell you that is not true one bit the tops of the trees are moving that thing looks amazing in the air though doesn't it here we go we're gonna inverted pass oh man Dan, feel good. Dan feels good about himself today because he's doing something that I can't do. <laughs> Normally I'm flying the helicopters. Now I have to edit that together to make it look like I'm doing that. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Dan is a lot better of a plane pilot than I am. I, uh, I just bang the sticks around and hope something cool comes out of it. Things doing 100 mile an hour to land, isn't it? <laughs> That's how you land it. Boom. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect.
Hey, it's got strong landing gear. It does have strong landing gear. What did you think of that? That thing was awesome, wasn't it? Oh, yeah. Thank that God thing flies. Carbon fiber landing gear. Thanks for letting me fly that thing. That thing is awesome. And that's only 60% throws. That's what's so crazy about this plane is I'm not advanced enough in the 3D stuff to be able to really throw it around that much, especially in this kind of wind. But this plane, it tracks straight. It feels like a, like a giant scale. I mean, it is a, fit, a 60 inch. So it, it is a big plane. But It'll go where you throw it. It's got a lot of power behind it, I can tell you that. And what's really cool is, so Dale, the owner of Buddy RC, told me something pretty funny. When I, pulled, when I pulled it in after I flew it, I touched the, uh, the motor and I said, oh, the motor's kind of cool, that's awesome. And he said, well, you didn't fly it hard enough. <laughs> so I, I, I had to redeem myself a little bit, but next time, next time, I got you, Dale, next time. But uh, thanks for tuning in, guys. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. I'm Clay. I'm Dan. And we'll see you in the next one. Watching.